Hello and welcome to my easy to understand guide to Stanley Cohen's theory about moral panics. Stanley Cohen identified that there were several times in the media where this feeling of fear was drummed up in an audience. People were made to feel scared that something dangerous was happening in society and he tried to identify what the effects of that actually were. So when he did the original research into this, he looked at research into the representation of people like mods and rockers, uh, punk bands, that kind of thing. And he looked at how they were demonised in the media, how the media reported on them as though they were evil, as though they were devil worshippers, as though they were going to corrupt society and how the media reported on and how they were going to, uh, you know, how this music was going to change young people and affect their behaviour. And what happened was this created a panic and a fear in society that somehow the world was going to change as a result of this type of music. He noticed how newspapers in particular drummed up this fear, repeating the stories, repeating the stereotypes, encouraging people to panic. And he noted that that was often because newspapers would sell more papers if their stories were very exaggerated and dramatic. The moral panics, this is what he calls it when society panics and fears something, that were drummed up often resulted in people campaigning against a particular issue. So, for example, when there was a moral panic about video games and violence in films back in the kind of 80s and 90s, um, Stanley Cohen noted that uh, a lot of the media drummed up these campaigns to get films banned. There were ideas that playing video games were going to turn your kids into violent killers and so he noted that these moral panics were caused by the media and actually had a direct impact on the way audiences behaved and responded. So um, have a think about some of the moral panics that might have been caused over the years. I've already spoken about the moral panic to do with things like rock music, punk music, video games, violence in films. There's more modern moral panics as well, such as the panic about drugs. There's also been quite a lot of fear mongering and the stirring up of hatred over things like uh, Islam and Muslims. Um, so there's been quite a big moral panic caused around the issue of, um, of Islam. And so um, have a think about the issues that you're seeing in the media around you and try and work out if the media, in particular news, have drummed up this sense of fear in an audience and whether that sense of fear has led to audiences wanting to change something about society. So that was my easy to understand guide to Cohen's Moral Panics. Don't forget to check out my channel for lots of other relevant, simple to understand videos about theories, set texts and keywords.